What is up, you guys? We are back again for another classic. This time we got Ted Healy's The Three Students MGM Short 1933 here in Pretzels. Let's go. Will you please listen? Don't be ignorant. This name Healy, Healy, and Healy should be up here in those Chinamen. Just listen, will you stop that nonsense? Now you keep on popping off, and I'm gonna smack you in a kisser. I can't hear oh. you. I'll smack you in a kisser. You can't bluff me. Hey, Curly, give him a few words. You can't do that to us. <laughs> I can't what? You ahead, can't Curly. do that. You bet your life, you bet your life you can't do that. They always use Curly as a shield every time. Curly, show him. That's what. <laughs> listen, Curly, when he throws a punch, don't forget. Duck. What? I say when he throws a punch, don't forget, duck! <laughs> I forgot to duck. <laughs> oh. Let me tell you one thing, young fella. Listen here. You've thrown us out of the theater into the gutter, and you hit me on the head. Now you cross our name off the board. I'm warning you now. I'm warning you. Don't go too far. So what? We quit. <laughs> I guess I told him a thing or two. Well, let me tell you a thing or two. Right. If it hadn't been for you, we wouldn't be thrown out of these theaters. Always fooling around with the girls instead of rehearsing the act. Yeah, I heard you tell <laughs> that girl they're going to put her name in electric light. Is that what I said? Yeah. You know, I was thinking of something else. Uh, let me tell you, from now on, I'm serious. No more girls. Strictly business. You mean that? If I'm lying, I hope you drop dead. Look at him already. You haven't got long to live, son. <laughs> at least he was honest to him. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you're a beautiful creature. How, uh, how would you like to have your name in electric lights? I'd like it. <laughs> so would I. Are you in show business? He was. Did you, ever hear, a gobble, a Did you ever hear of a gobble, a hollow? Did you ever hear of a bowl of soup? Yeah, when do we eat? Oh, they're so mundane. What's that? <laughs> Lady, I can't help it if I'm just naturally hereditary. <laughs> Look out. This is left for hanging. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> That's what they get. What's going on here? We uh, just dropped in to say hello. <laughs> we we sort of flew in. We uh, we were standing outside and uh, oh, 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 mademoiselle, oh mademoiselle, madame, mademoiselle, oh, oh, excuse me. Oh, it looked like so fell on his face. I'm so sorry. The most beautiful flower in your dressing room, beautiful indeed. You and your name in electric lights. Ha ha ha. <laughs> mm. Who is that? Oh, she's our biggest star. The biggest star. Oh. We got a good start, I guarantee you what? that. Who are you? And you? And you? And you? Give me, give me that, give me that. You know your troubles are all over? You don't need this anymore. <laughs> are you a lucky man? I suppose uh, we're hired? Hired? But what do you want? What do we want? We're four waiters. And besides being waiters, we're four of the greatest entertainers that ever hit a cafe floor. I'll give you a sample. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, you. you. <laughs> Wait. Yes? Can you take orders? Oh, can we take orders? Certainly we can take orders. Well, go on and jump on the lake. All right, boys. <laughs> go ahead. Jump on the lake. Okay, yeah, okay. okay. Sure. You know, I uh, I used to do solo work. In fact, not used to, I do solo work. You know, the average singer sings from here, but I sing right from here. Here we are. Where'd you go? 
We jumped the lake. We took your order. You took <laughs> my order. <Yeah. laughs> You are hired. We're hired. Yes. Go on. Get waiter's costume and be back at six o'clock, ready to work. If he only knew who he hired. <laughs> Get busy. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Exactly. That should be rule number one. Never hire the three stooges. <laughs> hired them. <laughs> Who belongs to this? I don't know. I don't know. What are you going to do with it? The thing to do is to take it and divide it up equally. Yeah, we're only stalling <laughs> around for something to eat, ain't we? Certainly. <laughs> Hi, Chief. And don't talk back to the head waiter. You hear me, don't you, son? Don't talk Ooh. back to the head waiter. I always give him a good slap for no right. reason. There's an old, old saying, heavy, heavy, what hangs over thy head. <laughs> back to the post, boys. Hurry up now. Into it. Hurry up there now. Hi, <laughs> You know, this is the first time I ever carried a tray. I used to be a, a head man, head man, just like you. Only I was a tall, dark, thin fella with a mustache. You know, I worked in uh, Delmonico's. <laughs> I worked in Sherry's. I worked in uh, Bacardi Rums. I worked in gins and all. <laughs> Here I go, another load. Did uh, you order, uh, order roast beef? Oh, thank you. Did the uh, lady, did you order roast beef? No. They didn't order roast beef. <laughs> you didn't order it by any chance. No, I guess you didn't order it. Did uh, you order roast beef? No. Well, don't jump to conclusions. Lady, did uh, you order roast beef? No. Well, somebody's got to get this roast beef. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, did anybody order roast beef? Hey, listen, I can't. 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 I can <laughs> you know, this is a high-class place. They always do it. This is where the real society people are. The real high-class society. The 400. Uh. Junior, will you watch your P's and Q's, please? What are you starting here? <laughs> what? Ladies what? and gentlemen, introducing Mademoiselle Bonnie Latour. <laughs> Hey, what I noticed in these um MGM shorts by uh Ted Healy and the Three Stooges, 1933, is they do a lot more singing compared to the newer ones. I just wanted to get that out there. All right, let's keep it rolling. Merry, merry world tonight. Merry, merry, merry world. Sing while you're able. Hearts like a feather. 
<laughs> she got some moves on her. <laughs> Episodes might not be as funny as the other ones as far as these two, the first two, but they do put on the show for you. <laughs> yeah, this they is call good. that talent. Think of it. They threw us out of a theater. Now here's we do our stuff. Hey, folks, get a load of this. We'll do our stuff. Now relax, fellas. Just relax. This is the time. Mm-hmm. Oh, there now, fellas. Be ashamed of yourself, you three fellas. Here you are, eating the man's them. food, singing and having a... <laughs> Don't talk back to me. Back to your work now. What? I say back to your work, son. Don't talk back to me. Back to your work. You know, they're very, very difficult boys to handle. <laughs> now, right here is where I do my stuff. Okay, hit that. Okay, Chris. 
To look at me, you'd never think that I was a multi-millionaire. Oh, come up. Wait a minute, boys. Wait a second. 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 Fellas, come here, William. Come here, William. I'll give you a nickel apiece. You understand? We're all partners. Don't worry. Well, what you say? All right. All right. I have traveled extensively from California to Maine, but of all the towns that I love best, give me that little girl. <laughs> Here I go with another load, folks. <laughs> oh, waiter. What's your order? Uh, we'd like some Petit de Fogwa. I know, but what do you want to eat? Petit de Fogwa is what we want to eat. Hey, you know, the boiled beef here so is very what good. Is that? Uh, we don't want boiled beef, we want Petit de Fogwa. I know, but the guy in that <laughs> kitchen over there, he makes it like nobody. The boiled beef is very good. We don't want boiled beef, we want Petit de Fogwa. Sure. Take my tip, take the boiled beef. Now listen, I don't want to argue with you. Where's the head waiter? Hey, head waiter! Head waiter! Come here! Yes, yes, yes. Straighten them out. All right. Get with me. <laughs> Deal me in. Sit down. Have something to eat. It's on the house. Hi. <laughs> what, uh, what seems to be the trouble? Now listen. I ordered Petty de Fogwa. <laughs> That's liable to happen to anybody. Well, so you ordered Petty de Fogwa. What happened? Well, he insists that the boiled beef is good. What do you think? The boiled beef is bad? Never argue with the customer. You know the customer's always right. You know that, don't you? I don't want to argue with you. I don't want to argue with you. Hold this. You've been arguing with the customers again, huh? The customer's always right. You get that? Yeah. Don't forget. No. What do you want? I want Petty de Fogwa. Uh, let me well, guess. Curly comes out next. You guys know Petty de There's four fellas. Wait, well, hold this. Here he goes. Never argue with the customer. <laughs> Remember, the customer's always right. This is a high-class joint. A victim of circumstance. What, what do you want? Oh, what's the matter? What's that? the matter? Hold this! Do what? Hold uh -oh. this! You know He's I'm about the boss, to don't get you? Him. Get out of here. Oh. Gouge your eyes out. Say, I got a tip for you. Yeah? What do you want? I'd like a ringside seat close to the orchestra. Hold this. Uh -oh. oh, he you got some. You can't get a ringside table here. Oh. I can? No, they're all taken. Oh, but I, I'd like to get up close where I can hear something. No, sir. Yeah, well, I, I'll tell you, my dear man, I, uh, I have five dollars. He's got five dollars! Who's got five dollars? Wait a minute, 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 Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Where's the money man? Who? Where's the money man? Where'd the man go? He's gone. Hey, Eddie! Hey! Hold that door! Hold that door! Somebody's dying in the brown suit. Looks like a woodchuck. Get him home! Did you see him sitting around here? Wait up! Where you been? Where you been? I'd like to have some lamb chops. You Never see. mind the lamb chops. Well, I'll You're going to hear it, boys. Yeah. Boys, you're going to hear the song. Yeah. Boom. Stein's on the table. You give me lamb chops. I don't care about it all. You see what I mean? I'm I'm good friend friend I want to know the time. It's time to get the table. I got him. I got him. Oh, and good friend is together. Hey, what's the coming off here? Uh oh. Back to those tables, boys. Hurry up, back to those tables. Go on, back to those tables. You want to be ashamed of yourself. Well, here I go with another load. <laughs> Say, you've got to take an order now. If you never ordered in your life, you've got to eat right now. Now is when you, you've got to eat right now. Oh, yeah. this, 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 about is to get fired. this is the manager. This the man that runs the whole place. These are people are friends of mine. I brought them in. They like my singing, you know. I hope you are enjoying the show. Yes, they enjoy the show. <laughs> Will you pardon me? Surely. I'll get you later. You should live so long. Oh! 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 You smell the song. Well, what about it? Oh, it's weird. Throw it right over your left shoulder this very minute. What for? Something is bound to happen oh, if you don't. Oh, nothing will happen here. I'll throw it over my shoulder, but I assure you, nothing will happen. <laughs> oh, who did it? Who did it? I'll murder somebody around. What's oh, you're throwing guys <laughs> around here. Get out of here. Oh, my gosh. Oh, oh, it's over. Oh, it's over. It's over. It's over! It's over! Here, stop it! <laughs> oh my gosh! Hang on! Oh, of 
force. You know, if I didn't throw that salt over my shoulder, something might have happened. And the manager was just beginning to like us. And that's why we're out here in the alley. This is final with me. No more girls, no more women, and no more skirts. You mean it? There's my hand. Oh. Money Change of heart. Hi, oh, yeah, <laughs> How would you like to have your name in electric lights? I'd love it. Oh, Come along, mister. Here I go with another load. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Well, I hope you guys like it. Like I said, the majority, these last, the first two, um, they have been more musicals and stuff like that, but they still have their elements where they make you laugh. Like the clothing of this one, beer and pretzels, it was like very funny. And like, you know, out of three stooges, sometimes they get into their bras and stuff like that. So it closed off like very, on a comedy level, but these first two episodes, it seemed like it's a, the three students are actually singing too, which is is different. But I enjoyed it. Till next time, we will see another classic. Peace. <laughs>